Hi, welcome to Keysight Bench View Lab Feature Guide. In this video, I will demonstrate the asset tracking feature which provides intuitive management tool for educators to easily keep track of a long list of assets in the lab including but not limited to instruments, equipment and accessories. The asset tracking is designed to manage instrument loaning and instrument calibration schedule tracking with email reminder system. Items may be added to the asset tracking list manually, import from lab layout, or import from CSV file. To add new asset manually, go to the asset tracking tab. Click the add new asset icon. Input the asset information. The assets model number, serial number, and asset number are mandatory fields that need to be filled. Other fields are optional and can be provided to allow easy filtering or searching and categorization of the assets in the future. If applicable, calibration information can also be provided, typically for test and measurement instruments that require intermittent calibration. Click OK to save the entry. The asset will now be on the asset full list. To make changes, click edit to edit the selected entry. If any modification to the entry is made, the date for last update is automatically recorded. You may also quickly import all the instruments from the lab layout previously configured into the asset tracking list. To import asset from lab layout, click on the application settings icon at the bottom right. Select Import Asset from Lab Layout. Select the desired lab layout. Click OK to add all the configured instruments from the selected lab layout. Note that only instruments that have been previously configured with model number and serial number will be added. The model number, serial number and asset number must be unique for each entry. Otherwise, an error message indicating duplicity will appear. Benchview Lab Manager includes management tools to keep track of instrument calibration. Calibration information can be added in each asset by selecting the desired asset and click Edit Asset icon. To view the list of instruments currently with calibration due date labs, click Pending Calibration Asset icon. The remaining days information in negative value indicates the number of days has lapsed since the calibration due date. After calibration has been completed, click Edit Asset icon on the selected instrument to update the calibration due date. The system will automatically track the next recurrent calibration due date. Asset checking out feature is useful for tracking the physical location of the instruments where it is often sent out for loan or calibration. To check out an item, click the Asset Available for Checkout icon. The list shows items that are currently available in the lab. Select the desired item for checking out and click the Checkout icon. Fill in the checkout information. To view all the items currently being checked out and to edit the checkout information, click the Asset Checkout List icon. Click the Edit icon of the desired item. You may edit the checkout information and click Save to save the changes. To check in the item when it is returned, click the Check in icon. The item will now be moved back to the Asset Available for Checkout list. The Benchview Lab Manager provides automatic reminder notification for instrument calibration due date and asset checkout end date. The reminder notification settings are customizable according to the user preferences. To configure reminder settings, click on the configure reminder settings icon. That is the end of this video. Thank you for watching.